It's minus 18 degrees Celsius just outside the Swedish mining town of Kiruna, north of the Arctic Circle. In this environment, Volvo cars winter test their cars and it is here that the Volvo C30 electric has to show its true colours. Extreme cold can be a particular challenge for electric cars. The winter is affecting the electric car uh, in such a way that we have to uh, adjust the temperature for the uh, compartment where the driver is sitting and also for the battery so that they can deliver the power that is requested. But there are technical solutions that maintain heat for both batteries and passengers inside the car in conditions like these. When it's cold, an ethanol-powered fuel heater can help to maintain a warm temperature. We have managed this in the C30 electric by using three different uh, climate systems which cooperate and distribute heat where it's needed and optimised to the driving conditions. How far can you drive when it's minus 10 degrees Celsius? In minus 10 I would say that you can drive uh, 80 to 90 kilometres and of course it's depending on how you're driving. Volvo cars are in the middle of their final winter tests for electric cars. We do it like a normal customer, start the car and take away. Uh, the expectation of the car is just like any day of the year. It copes very well with the driver and uh, we have driven it down to minus 33 degrees Celsius outside and uh, inside the coupe it's warm and cosy. What do the journalists who have test driven the electric car on site in this Arctic winter think? It differs very little from driving a petrol or a diesel driven car. Uh, I would say it's so little difference that you, don't, you won't even notice it if it's an automatic gearbox in the car. It was uh, warm as a normal car, just put on the AC and then it was just fine. We took the car, it was 18 minus uh, Celsius in the air. Uh, we had three three minutes we had uh, acceptable heat in the car which I think is uh, very good. Well it seems that the Volvo C30 electric has no problem coping with the cold. The car's unique climate control system has sufficient capacity to warm up the batteries and still ensure that it is more than acceptably warm inside the car. It's possible to drive up to 70 or 80 kilometres, even if it's extremely cold, minus 33 degrees, for example. Volvo Cars has a strong belief in the future of the electric car that can, in fact, provide up to 90% of our daily requirements of personal transport by car.